to demonstrate something I ran into. I don't know if this is a bug or not, but it seemed a little strange. So what I have here is a basic um, sketch with uh, some noise as a signal coming in, and then I'm manipulating that noise uh, with some more noise, and I'm just outputting that <coughs> just to have something there. And what I'm looking at doing is having the auto UI uh, develop a control panel for the parameters within the noise and also for this level top that's here. So pretty basic and I've already used the um, basic widgets uh, from the palette and I've also used the auto UI uh, to generate this screen here and um, that all is working. If I change this to uh, default viewer, I can go in there and I can change these and you can see here on the my preview it is cornering here. Okay, it's changing my settings. So that's that's all working as it should. But what I really want is at the same time to have this mapped to a MIDI controller. And what I have found is that um, it's either one or the other, not both. And I'm going to show what I mean by that. So I'm going to actually um, move this back to the operator viewer for our effects area here. And uh, here I've got a, a Korg Nano control uh, that I'm going to map just these two parameters. And uh, I'm going to bring up my... Um, custom controls here for this one and right here they're already open actually and I'm going to go back to my MIDI knob here and I'm going to map these so I'll map this over here map reference I can see here I've got everything set up and if I change that knob I can see everything change and we'll do the same thing with amplitude so that all changes great. All right, so I should be out of the woods, but if I go back to, uh, if I leave it alone, everything's okay. And uh, that's fine. If I want to also have some kind of on-screen control at the same time, and at any point initialize the auto UI over here that I built, um, it's going to take these mappings away. So if I go to um, here and I turn this back to default or to uh, default viewer, we're going to see here I just lost all of my MIDI mapping. And uh, it doesn't seem to matter where I place my MIDI mapping um, module here. If I place it inside of this effects container, it doesn't matter. If I place it inside of my basic widgets, I even tried that. In any case, um, whenever I go back to using the UI, it completely redoes my MIDI, actually it erases the MIDI mapping, which is uh, a little annoying because if you want to have both for some reason, it doesn't appear that you can. Uh, so if somebody knows how to have both, let me know.